It's minus two degrees, and the world has come to a standstill. The cold has drained all the colour out of the land. Today, I'm at the ancient site of Clava Cairns in the north of Scotland, and it's freezing. Walking across the road and alongside a field takes you to an uninspiring heap of stones, bereft. Bereft comes from an old English word meaning to plunder or rob, and never was a word so fitting of a place. There was once another great chambered cairn here, on the plain called Milton of Clava, but it's said that many centuries ago, people scattered the cairn and plundered the stone to build St Bridget's Chapel. And now, all that is left is this one standing stone. And snow on the altar. So I'll admit to feeling a little bit intimidated by the idea of scoring for snow on the altar, this little piece that I just made. I mean, Clava Cairns is, after all, a really vital, important part of the landscape of the Highlands. It's, it's a landmark that's been there for thousands of years. And even today, people still don't really fully understand what it was built for and how it was used. But I came home from my very, very cold walk yesterday afternoon and opened up Cubase Pro and I launched one of my um, favourite go-to instruments, which is the Maverick piano from Native Instruments, which is actually an old sort of half-broken upright that they recorded. Um, and I wanted something that wasn't too perfect, the sound of the piano that was a little bit crushed. And I just started tinkering around with a little melody that I felt really summed up for me the essence of this magical place. And I layered that up with some harmonic strings over the top of that and then later introduced some warm strings down the bottom. I mean, Milton of Claver, it's, it's a pretty bleak place, you can't get around that. But at the same time, there's this beautiful optimism um, standing in a place that's been inhabited or used for thousands of years, and this ancient medieval church that has crumbled into ruins. Even still, somebody at one point felt this place was worthy of erecting such a monument. Um, you know, a religious place that, that anyone with any sensitivities, you can feel just how special it is. And while I was standing there trying to take um, some photos, of course, I was just astonished that it started to snow, bleak as it was, which made the perfect photograph. And I tried to convey some of that magic and mystery just in the music. Really, I can't think of a better way to spend an hour on a Sunday afternoon as the sun goes down, just exploring a place like that and listening to the music as it bubbles up inside me. So I really hope you enjoyed joining me on this mini-adventure, hopefully one of many more to come in the coming year, 2023. So if you have any questions about how I put together the video or the music or where to get hold of the piece, just let me know in the comments below.